Hello there, you know what this video is. This is my 365th video of the year. I have officially done it. I uploaded a video every single day for the year 2019. It has been amazing. It has been quite the little adventure. It has been pretty hard, actually harder than I thought it would be. But here we are, video 365. Thank you for being here with me. Doing this challenge, I knew from the very beginning, I thought there will come a day, maybe more than one day, when I just have to post something, even though I'm not really ready, because I'm gonna have to post a video every single day. So I might have to just sit down and chat or do something kind of on the fly because what I wanted to do didn't happen. I thought that would happen quite a bit. It didn't. Today is the day. Number 365. This is the day. This is not the video that I wanted to post. The video that I have been trying to work on is a celebration video for year end, and I simply have not been able to get it done. I haven't been able to get it done for a number of reasons. One is the videos I posted this week were a lot longer than I had anticipated, and they took a lot longer to edit than I had anticipated. That wasn't the only thing. I've been having a lot of other things happening this week. The major thing I can't tell you about yet, but I will tell you about it in two weeks. I'm going to skip a Monday Musing and then I'll come back for another Monday Musing and I will tell you that and tell you what's been going on. But in addition to that, we had a water main issue at the house. This has been an ongoing problem. It took a long, long time to resolve, a lot longer than it should have. So we kept having water on and off. It was just a fiasco that didn't make sense and it confused the city and they ended up taking a water meter. It was just very weird. Everything got all straightened out and there was no bad guy in the whole thing. It was just confusion. <laughs> <laughs> but it was confusion that put me out of water. And when they realized I was completely out of water, the city did jump on that and they went to go fix it. Or they at least put in a stop gap. Let me put it that way. So I had water running to the house, but it wasn't truly fixed for quite some time. And that has to do with the public works or the people who provide the water at the city aren't the same people who do the permits. Getting that to coordinate and getting people to understand the sort of unique issue, it was just a puzzle. And it was a puzzle that finally I had a champion at the city step in and say, listen, I'm going to deal with this and I'm going to make these two groups come together and figure this out. And he did that. I was very grateful and I do now have water, which is fabulous. Not only that, but my internet has been going in and out. Spectrum, they said, you know, I don't have an overall outage. That has not been the issue. It is my modem. They have replaced it and I'm still having the issue. It's weird. It just goes off. The, you know, the light just goes off and it just goes off and we don't know why. And then they'll schedule somebody to come out, but before they come out, it'll be back up and I didn't I didn't do anything. The light just came on. It just decided to work. The problem with that obviously is in uploading videos because it'll go out in the middle of uploading a video and then I have to start over. So that has been a challenge on top of that, YouTube has been weird. When you upload the video, it'll upload, but then YouTube doesn't recognize the processing sometimes. And I found a workaround for that, a YouTube hack that gets that to work. That's a known issue. So it has just been one thing after another. It has been very frustrating, especially when I'm trying to upload a video every day and the videos were longer, where normally I might do a five or 10 minute video. I have been doing 20 to 30 minute videos and all of that takes a lot longer to do. So the long and the short of it is this video did not get done the way I wanted it to and it would take some research to get it done. It just didn't get done. You gave me photographs, a lot of you did that, and rather than putting them in here, I am going to plan to do a proper video and have your photographs in there. So what that means is if you didn't get your photo in and you would like to, you still have a little while to do it. If you want to do that, it's just send it to Jill Mauer Jewelry at G email.com. I know that some of you probably don't want to really show your face. Again, I'm not asking for any naughty photos here, but if you don't want to show your face or if you just want to show in profile or shadow, if you'd like to share a photo, we would love to see it. You know, just to see a little more about who we're talking to 
that is up to you. I do have to keep this video reasonably short because I don't know how difficult it is going to be to upload. I want to tell you that in yesterday's Monday Musing, I did let you know I'm going to continue the Monday Musings for now. I'm just not going to commit to doing them every single week. And to make sure that I don't feel like I'm committed to that, I'm going to take two weeks off. I am going to come back in a Monday Musing, not this coming Monday, but the Monday after that. And I will tell you more about what has been going on in my life and where I am and some of my plans for the future. So look forward to that. And we'll talk more as we go forward about 2020 and some of the things I would like to do in 2020. This week felt a little to me like there was a big challenge at the finish line as I was trying to sprint toward the finish line. And even though this video is not what I had planned, I have to stop and say I did it. I really did it. It was a challenge and it was a challenge accepted and completed. Thank you again for being here. It has meant so much to me and I do hope to see you going forward. Until then. Bye.